According to the U.S. Energy Information Administration, hydroelectric power generates around 7% of the nation's energy. Motion-generated energy from moving water can be used to generate electricity. This is known as hydropower or hydroelectricity. A riverbank dam is used in the most common type of hydroelectric power plant to store water in a reservoir. When water released from the reservoir runs through a turbine and spins it, a generator is activated to produce energy. Hydroelectric power can be produced without a large dam, though. Some hydroelectric power plants only channel river water into a turbine by passing it through a small canal. Here are some of the amazing hydroelectric technologies that will change our world. Make sure to stick around till the end. Make Open Hydro. We set sail for Open Hydro, North America's largest tidal power facility off the coast of Canada, as we continued our exploration into renewable energy. Imagine a five-story edifice that is a thousand tons in weight. This isn't just another behemoth. It's a green monster that can power a whole town with its astounding 16 megawatts of electricity. This feat of engineering, created by the Canadian company Emera and the Irish company Open Hydro, has been using the sea's energy since November 2022. Now consider this. Two 53-meter diameter turbines, each secured by 120-meter long cables, make up Open Hydro. This indicates that we can power around a thousand homes without producing a single trace of greenhouse gas thanks to the turbulent vortex and open hydro's tidal capability. Turbulent. Disrupting the hydroelectric power industry. They change the game. Turbulent turbines are more inexpensive and economical than conventional power plants, which is a marvel of contemporary design. Imagine having it running smoothly in a river or canal with just minor elevation fluctuations in a week. It is producing electricity for you, day or night, in good weather or bad. This is how it goes. This clever turbine turns the flow of water into spinning energy by generating a swirling vortex in a concrete basin. It has the potential to produce up to an incredible 70 kilowatts, depending on the water flow rate. Enough electricity to run six or seven homes. The best thing, though? It's friendly to the environment. The design guarantees the safety of our aquatic buddies, and it has a remarkable lifespan of more than 100 years. Water Oto We're about to see another trailblazer, the Water Oto, a revolutionary technology that generates power from still bodies of water. Water Oto has you covered, producing anywhere between one kilowatt and one megawatt of power from streams, rivers, canals, or even ocean currents moving as slowly as three kilometers per hour. It complements our other zero-emission products wonderfully because it is small, portable, and environmentally beneficial. Up to 20 units may fit in the back of a truck, providing electricity without harming native flora and animals to even the most distant regions of the world. Water Oto, a concept developed by brilliant brains at the University of British Columbia, is a tested technology that powers off-the-grid places and rural communities. Landistry. We now travel to Landistry, Netherlands, to meet the next game-changing invention, Landustrix screw turbine, which, in keeping with Dutch proficiency in water management, converts canal height differences into power. It's amazing how much power it can produce with just a one meter height differential and a 500 liter per second water flow. The Landustrix screw turbine is small, simple to install, and economical in terms of maintenance costs, just like its forebears. It is tough and can survive ice and harsh canal conditions while protecting our aquatic creatures. It is impressive that it can continually produce up to 100 kilowatts of electricity and that it continues to provide energy even when there is little water flow. The fact that it has no emissions is the best part. Tom Salk The largest pumped storage hydroelectric power plant in the world, Tom Salk, is located in Missouri, the Show Me State. Imagine this. Two reservoirs, 
the tallest standing at 720 metres, the other at 450 metres. They release water down to spin turbines and produce electricity when demand for power spikes. The water is pumped back up at night using extra energy from various sources. Simple, but brilliant. Tom Sork, built in the 1960s and named for a mountain nearby, had an initial capacity of 800 megawatts. After an overhaul, it now boasts a powerful 1,020 megawatts. With up to 85% of the energy needed to pump water back up, Tom Sok, like all of our stations, is a testament to effective and sustainable power generating. Orbital Zero Two. Let's cross the Atlantic to the frigid waters around Scotland's Orkney Islands after marvelling at American inventiveness. The Orbital O2, a tidal turbine created by the Scottish business Orbital Marine Power, is located there. This enormous tower weighs 680 tonnes and is as tall as a 24-storey building. Nevertheless, despite its size, its environmental impact is minimal. Zero emissions represent a real departure from fossil fuels. The secret of the Orbital O2 is its ability to generate power in both directions, which considerably boosts its efficiency. Launched in July 2021, this energy giant will harness the force of the sea to provide our houses with enough electricity each year for 2,000 households. Uniwave 200 As we continue our journey, let's dock in Australia, home of Uniwave 200, a groundbreaking wave power generator created by Swell Energy and inspired by the breathing passages of marine creatures. This 20-metre-tall and 10-metre-wide Australian marvel uses wave action to move air inside a concrete chamber. A wind turbine powered by this displacement can generate up to 200 kilowatts of electricity. What distinguishes Uniwave 200? It can be used in a variety of locales because tidal variations have no effect on its functionality. It also provides a financially viable option for the production of renewable energy. A larger, more powerful version of the project, which is currently an experimental one, might power our future if it is successful. Micro-hydro turbine system. Let's examine the power of micro-hydro turbine systems, which produce electricity on a small scale, in the concluding installment of our exploration of sustainable micro-hydro turbine system energy. They are ideal for lighting up isolated settlements, houses or businesses, and can even be used to power irrigation systems thanks to their cleanliness, efficiency and affordability. They are flexible, effortlessly integrating into a variety of watercourses, from rivers to irrigation canals, and providing a simple, low-cost electrical source. Size can range from producing a few watts to generating megawatts, supplying electricity around the clock with no pollution. The Wavestar Machine As we continue on our quest, we come across the Wavestar Machine, another intriguing piece of modern renewable energy technology. Wavestar, a Danish business, came up with the idea. This wonder uses the rhythm of the waves of the ocean to illuminate our life. Imagine a floating energy farm that is attached to the ocean floor and has a number of floats that move with the waves. Wave motion is transformed into useful electricity by this motion, which operates a generator and a hydraulic system. It promises scalability and adaptability to a variety of wave situations and power requirements, and is now making waves in Norway. This environmentally friendly machine produces no emissions and has a big future in renewable energy. As studies proceed outside of Norway, anticipate commercial availability soon. Today, we have experienced awed-inspiring advancements in renewable energy, each more promising than the previous. Keep in mind that every watt we produce cleanly is a win for the environment. Our future is renewable as we continue to discover the power of the tides, waves, and tiniest streams. 
don't keep your excitement about these developments to yourself if you share my enthusiasm. Click the like button, share this video, and invite more people to the discussion. Together, let's spark a revolution. To ensure that you don't miss out on our upcoming adventure, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. As always, thank you for watching and remember to keep learning. Thank you.